Hi everyone. This video is for women, not for kids or for teachers. Today I want to talk about something that has helped me in my Christian walk. Before I get started though, let me read something from the Bible to you. It's Hebrews 12 verses 1 through 2 says, Therefore, since we are surrounded by so great a cloud of witnesses, let us also lay aside every weight and sin which clings so closely, and let us run with endurance the race that is set before us, looking to Jesus, the founder and perfecter of our faith, who for the joy that was set before him endured the cross, despising the shame, and is seated at the right hand of the throne of God. So let me go back and read that part that says, let us lay aside every weight and sin which clings so closely and let us run with endurance. So I have a little idea that has helped me through many, many years to kind of break some sin habits. So I am very known for wearing something on my wrist. Um, and here you just see some of those bracelets that have the little symbols or special. This one says Jesus is greater. And so I might wear one of these you know, if I'm going somewhere because I want somebody to see it and I want maybe them to ask me about it and will give me a chance to share the gospel. But that's not what I'm talking about today. Today I'm talking about something that I wear on my wrist that helps me. It's not for anybody else, but it's only for me. Now, often I will wear a rubber band or sometimes a silly band. Do you remember these little silly bands? So I have a few left over from when my kids had lots of these laying around. And so I will often put one on my wrist to remind me of something that I'm working on. For example, I'll take the pink one sometimes and I'll put it on my wrist and it'll remind me to watch my tongue. If I'm just going through a period where I've just gotten in some bad habits of being negative, that will help just be a visual reminder to me to guard my tongue. Or, for example, if I just want to focus more on God and just all throughout the day, remember to pray without ceasing, I might put on a purple one so that I'm just remembering, you know, God, royalty, holy, let me just focus on him throughout the day and not forget. Um, sometimes I might be working on uh, just a particular thing like money, just saving my money or watching, you know, get every dollar and that kind of thing. And so I might wear like a green one just to remind myself about, you know, I just have been convicted about wrong spending. So you can see how this could help you as a visual reminder just for you to remember to lay aside those things, those sins that cling to us. Because don't they do that? Don't they cling to us? You know, it is very um, easy to pick up bad habits, but it's hard to break them. So I need that visual reminder. So today I thought what we would do is I have some embroidery thread. Now remember, this; these bracelets are bright and beautiful. They're meant for other people to see. But the ones that we're talking about, the visual reminders are just for you. So we don't want them to be flashy or bold. So I have just some simple embroidery thread and we're gonna use that to make a little bracelet. So let's get started. So there are many different ways to make a little embroidery bracelet, but I'm just gonna do this one. It's pretty simple. It's called a spiral staircase. So I just have three pieces of embroidery thread, one, two, three, and I tied them in a knot together and I just put them under the clip of a clipboard, but you could also just tape it on your table with a little piece of tape if you wanted to. So basically you take the three pieces of thread and you put these two together and you have this piece and you bring it into like the number four shape. And then you take the end of that and you go through the hole and you slide it all the way up. And you just do that again. Number four, Go under, put it in the hole, and then slide it all the way up. So number four, put it in the hole, slide it up. And you just continue to do that. So there's number four, and then I'm just taking it and putting under and into the hole and then sliding it up. And let me get a little bit closer so you can see, I hope, hope it'll focus. You can kind of see that it starts to spiral around and around and around. So you can continue until you have a little green bracelet that you can wear as a reminder. And you can use any color. Embroidery floss is very inexpensive. You can get a pack with lots of colors and make lots of these to use as reminders of the sins and habits that you want to break. 
So here's my little bracelet to help me remember to watch my spending, especially now that the holidays are upon us. I have to tell you that took a little bit longer than I probably wanted to spend. So I would recommend if you don't want to do the twisty, you know, special one, um, maybe just braid it. Just get three stand strands and braid it because remember, it's not the point. It's the point is that it's not going to be flashy or for everybody else to see. Just a gentle reminder, just for you. Hope this was helpful to you and a blessing, and I'll see you next time. Have a wonderful day.